Yo guys, what's up? It's Dave, the Open Source Cancer here, and for today's video, I'm going to show you how you can Wi-Fi tether for free on your Sprint or Verizon HTC One M8. Now to do this, you will need to have a reading Android device. So first, you're going to want to buy an app called Wi-Fi Tether Router. Now this is a paid app, and it's going to cost you about $2.50. However, it's definitely worth it, considering that you would normally pay $30 for a tethering plan and whatnot. So Definitely buy this app, it's really worth it, and this is the only app that I could find that works with Android KitKat. Okay, so as soon as you open up, what we're going to need to do is we're going to have to configure the Wi-Fi router. So go to configure Wi-Fi router. Now of course, you can change the network name and encryption type and all that good stuff. But what we're going to want to do is actually go down to interface, make sure it's on wireless LAN 0, or the default value pretty much. And then go to method, and make sure the method is on host APD. That way it'll work and you'll be able to actually get you know a working connection. So like I said, other than that, you can customize the network name and encryption and encryption to whatever you desire. So I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna enable Wi-Fi router. Now this is your first time doing it, is gonna ask you for super user permission. So make sure you grant that. And this is gonna take just a few seconds to start up. So just give it some time and be patient. Okay, and here we have it. Right now. As we can see, we are actively tethering because at the bottom is sent data, received data, and we're on LTE. So on my tablet right over here, I'm just going to connect to the network. So on my tablet, I'm just going to go to settings, Wi-Fi, Android is beast, oh yeah, and connect. And connecting, connecting, connected, awesome. Right now on the device shows data being sent and received, and I can go to black and white list. And it's going to show me the Nexus 7 right now that I connected, uh, the MAC address and IP address and all that good stuff. I'm going to go back and I'm going to hit the Wi-Fi router. And perfect. So just remember this does kind of run your battery a little bit warm and it also drains your battery life. So just keep that in mind when you're tethering, then the other device is going to run warm and your battery life is going to drain fairly quickly. But yeah, so guys, this has been how to Wi-Fi tether for free on HC1 M8. Like I said, you definitely need a rooted Android device for this to work, but definitely try it out. And you know, it's always good to be on the tether on the go. So guys, thanks for watching and stay tuned for another guys and video. Thanks.